the outline of this video is relational decomposition we will study in this lecture types of decomposition lossless decomposition dependency preserving lossless decomposition explained with an example right so let's get started now relational decomposition what is relational decomposition when a relation that is a table in the relational model this relation in a relational model is also known as a table right uh, when the table is not in an appropriate normal form that is there is some redundancy present in this table then the decomposition of a relation is required right so we need to decompose that table so that we can reduce it to normal form in a database it breaks the table into multiple tables right so basically we are breaking the relation or table into a multiple number of tables so that we can reduce it into a normal form if the relation has no proper decomposition then it may lead to problems like loss of information right so if you keep decomposing the table into multiple tables what happens is there might be and you don't do it properly then it can lead to problems like loss of information right so decomposition is used to eliminate anomalies inconsistencies and redundancy redundancy basically means repetition right inconsistency means not being in a state of not being in a consistent state and anomalies are some odd behavior right so types of decomposition there are two types of decomposition here lossless decomposition and dependency preserving de uh, de decomposition right so let us look at them one by one now coming to lossless decomposition right so lossless decomposition if the information is not lost from the relation that is when you are dividing the table or relation then if the information is not lost from it then that is uh, when the table is decomposed then the decomposition is lossless that is you are not losing any information so that decomposition is also known as lossless decomposition the lossless decomposition guarantees that the join of relations will result in the same relation as it was decomposed that is when you join the table again these two tables which you have divided this bigger table into a smaller set of tables if you join them you will get the same information right so no information has been lost the relation is said to be lossless decomposition if natural joins of all the decomposition give the original relation that is this natural join of all the decomposed tables will give you the original table or relation for an example i have given here employee de department detail table right employee department table i have given as an example here the employee ids are following that is 22 33 46 52 62 and 60 employee names are these and employee age is this and employee city is this and and department id is this and department name is this now let us see the example in detail the above relation is decomposed into two relations employee and department why are we breaking this uh, relation into two tables because we have to reduce the redundancy in the uh, table and reduce it to normal form right so employee table is different and department table is different i have divided this bigger table into two smaller tables that is employee details are given in a separate table and department details are given in a separate table now employee id is this employee name is this employee age employee city and department id employee id and department name is this when these two relations are joined in the on the common column employee id this common is this column employee id is common in between these two tables employee id is common between these two tables when they are joined together then the resultant relation will look like this then the resultant relation when they are joined together will look like employee id employee name employee age employee city department id department name hence the decomposition is lossless joint decomposition because no information was lost in the case of this example right mm, so subscribe to my channel if you found this content useful and thank you for watching everyone i will see you in the next video take care guys